Hi everyone, I'm Shauna. Uh, welcome to my channel, Rescued Relics. So today we have a game to play. The question is, which one of these items would you think is worth the most money? And let me just uh, preface it by saying that the year is 2023. It is April. And so, of course, this might change if you're seeing this years later. But as of now, I wanted to share with you the value of these items. And it's not always what you think it is. So here we have a Black & Decker Space Saver can opener. It is vintage. Still works, my sweetheart tested it. It does not have the um, attach attaching screws. Some of them that are sold do have the attaching screws, but that didn't seem to affect the price. This item is a Starbucks coffee press. Uh, it is used, but was only used a couple times. As you can tell, it's in good condition. No notable issues. And right here we have the everyday in circulation used $1 bill. So, question is, which one is worth the least amount of money? We'll work our way up. If you guessed Starbucks coffee press, you win this round. <laughs> Believe it or not, this item, a new one sells for about $12 and that's with free shipping. No, wait, no, a new one sells about $12 plus shipping. So this one, since it's used, sells for six, about six bucks. That's what I have it listed for is $6. So the shiniest out of all of these is worth the least. Now, out of these two items, which one is this one worth a dollar? Or is it more? Is this one worth more than this dollar? Okay. Can I get a drum roll, please? This one is the second most valuable. This right here, uh, there are sold comps for $30. People have them listed between 15 and 30. Uh, once we get this cleaned up, uh, it might sit for a while, but people really are looking for space saving options and probably love it and be like oh I remember when I was a kid I had that so this uh, style what's it even say does it have a it doesn't have black and decker space maker but I thought maybe it had it and it has a little bag opener here oh and the model let's see let's look at the model because people put the model number in there sometimes I don't know I don't see it anyway Type one, maybe the type has something to do with it. I'll have to do some more research. But anyway, we're gonna say 15 to $30. So anyway, if you guessed the $1 bill is the most expensive item, most valuable item out of these three, you win. Yay. What do we win? Bragging rights, you win the game. All right of today. Pew, pew, pew. I give you fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> Believe it or not, this dollar bill just sold. We had it as an auction and it sold for $28.17. Now this is one item, almost every other item we've ever had, we always just do buyer pays shipping, right? Buyer pays shipping. But since it was a dollar, I figured it'd probably just be easy to ship it first class, this kind of thing. So I did say free shipping. So we'll have to take off probably what, $3, whatnot. So anyway, but $28.17, and let me tell you why. It's because of these little numbers right here. They call that 
the five zeros. This is a low number. Uh, it's a 2017. And that's right there, 2017 series. And there's, it's all about the number. Now, and also if these didn't, if these weren't the same number, it'd be worth more. But are you kidding me? Or if it was a star note. Yeah. But, but I mean. <gasps> Turning. A $27.17 profit. Right. Oh, no, but whatever. Make $27.17 off of a dollar. That's no, pretty good right there. Yeah. So look at your dollar bills. Yeah, check your money. Check your money. I do it all the time. I'm like, oh, wait, let me look at that before I go and buy some. Oh, wait. And if you hear some noise in the background, those are our two doggos. It's these little monsters down here. Who's winning? <laughs> Who's winning? Buddy or Bailey? Know. Bailey's getting bigger. Yeah, we're starting to play a little bit more. Yep. All right. All right. So thanks for playing and happy treasure hunting.